Um, just over and over time, just going there, uh, getting a vibe for it. But I was like really sold on the like a couple weeks ago with um, me and my family. We took a visit, and um, I was like, Mom, it just eating me up that Auburn is place where I need to be. What about the impression maybe this year's defense and Coach Steele has had? I mean, can you really picture yourself in that offense? Yeah, I can picture myself in the defense. Um, physical, um, they fast, they get into the football. I mean, they're playing defense like, like they should play defense. Um, Coach Steele, yeah, he's, 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 he got his hand in it. And uh, the, the, the coaches around him, I mean, they all just sold in on one. So, I mean, the defense that they're playing is great. The offense they're playing, but they, they playing great football. How big of a factor is, I guess, the success this year? So, I mean, you obviously have confidence in your ability to turn around anything, but just to see kind of the way that these two players, the way they're playing, and how you can fit into that, how big of a factor is um, it? It's, it's, it's all right. I mean, I don't look at the school on like what I can do for the school. I look at the school on like what they can do for me. Um, on and off the field, Auburn is um, the place that I felt like that I was comfortable saying that uh, that's the best school for me. Um, education is a, is a factor. Uh, family is a factor. Um, I'm, I'm, I was born in Open Like a Hospital, um, so I'm like, literally 15 minutes away. I got a family in Tuskegee, so. Um, Family, uh, football, education, all this stuff is, is, is going to be a byproduct of like what I'm going to do on the field. So uh, that, that's, how, that's how I feel. I saw you get pretty emotional up here. Yeah. I mean, this is a pretty special day. This isn't just like a decision that you made on a whim. I mean, this is, this is something that's bigger than that. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's, it's big. I mean, like I, I used to pray. I used to pray about this, this for God to give me a chance with the college uh, process. So, I mean, him working in my favor, and then uh, just doing it for my, my my people, like just doing it for everybody that has has wanted to see me uh, get right here. My family um, praying for me every night, uh, praying for myself every night. Uh, my grandma, my grandparents that's in heaven. Everybody just had a factor in it, and I just, I couldn't, you know, it was just big. It's, it's a big moment. Did anything happen along the way that changed your mind? Uh, yeah, I mean, um, I, when, once I had my rig this summer, uh, I kind of seen who was there for me the most, because um, I know that it, it might, I think God put me through that for a reason. Um, I was sold on going to Georgia, but um, after the rig, I mean, the coaching staff, I mean, they all had, that was like unbelievable to me and my brother, to my parents. Um, otherwise, like I just felt like if I ever, if I ever need something from them, and if I ever need something uh, big, if, if I ever go to the college, they, they, they have me. They have my back, and like I have their back. And I needed that, and I needed somewhere I could go to a family field, someone that I could trust them, they could trust me, and, and that's what I wanted. Uh, it was this summer. Um, I wanted to go to Georgia. I mean, I, I, thought, I thought that that was going to be the place for me, but I, I prayed and took my time, and I think God revealed to me what my best place was to be. Graduating early, talk about being at the, at the spot six months before I'm going to try to get the campus, get a feel for the campus, try to get ahead in, in things that I need to get ahead in, try to get ahead in my classes, try to get ahead uh, learning the playbook, trying to get ahead and fitting in. So um, going to school six months early is going to be a bit, big benefit to me, my family, and everything that I have planned to do. How exciting is this day being able to kind of get it all off the chest and, and know exactly where you're going? Let it's huge, else. man. It's huge because I, I was getting overwhelmed, stressed out. So now I'm, I'm straight. I know what it is. I just wore eagle, baby. How much was the, uh, the video? How much was your idea? How much was their idea? Like uh, I, I, I gave it to them. I was like, y'all just figure out, because I'm not a big planner. I don't like to plan that much, so I was like, yeah, I just do what you have to do. Uh, I was over here earlier. What did you decide Auburn and uh, The feel of signing with Auburn is the best feeling. I mean, just knowing in my heart what, where I needed to go and knowing where I was supposed to go and knowing where, I, where the best place for me, it was the best feeling. Uh, I spoke with T.D. Moultrie a few weeks ago at his uh, Senior Bowl declaration. He talked about... He would love to play with you. I mean, it's not his decision, but he, he says you two talk about what it would be like lining up with one another to call his defense. Is that something you think about as well? Yeah, I mean, we, we said back back in back this spring that we we're gonna do a package deal, and, and it always been there. TD is my brother. I mean, I love that guy. I mean, so we always talk at least three times a week. He called me. Man, what y'all what y'all practice is like, man? It was good, man. What y'all what about y'all? I mean, we, we just have genuine conversations. We we we, we fuel about the same gas. Um, we, I think us together, I'll, I'll be, I'll be good for just 
for any, anything, anything. He, he's, a, he's a good dude and I love him. I mean, that familiarity in just your relationship with him, was that a factor in your decision? Yeah, um, not, not, not for real because he knew just like I knew I had to do the best decision for me. Um, we, we had a relationship before the uh, before the recruiting process came up, uh, so uh, he knew that I had to do the best decision for me, and I knew he had to do the best decision for him. Uh, I'll probably play like a mic. Uh, it, it played a it played a huge part because I wasn't like one of them guys that, that that has been recruited ever since my sophomore year. Um, I. Like, I knew that I had talent, but I knew that I had abilities and capabilities to play on the SEC level. So, I mean, I used to pray for schools just to look at me. So, um, I pray, and like my pastor always say, nothing is too hard for God because in, his, in, in our weakness, his strength is made perfect. So, I mean, I was weak in, the, in my point that, that I wasn't getting the looks that I wanted, but it wasn't going to take control of my life, I mean, because I have grades too. So, I was just saying... Um, I, it just played a, a huge part because I, I trusted in him and, like, and he trusted in me and he got me to, he got to me to where I am right now. Yeah, got to. Yes, sir. Talk about the, uh, the playoff final coverage. Um, I expect a lot, a lot about it. Um, I don't expect none, none less of my team. We're trying to make it a perfect season. We're not, per, we're not perfect by any means, but we're gonna try to make the, our record perfect. Um, we have many flaws, but we, we're gonna play football. We're gonna get down with you.